Wait to get the win. Um, you know, we didn't make it easy. We had opportunities uh, there in the second quarter, third quarter, really to to uh, put it away. Uh, but I mean, I tell you what, you got to give the guys credit. And right there, at a three-point game. That's that's when it challenges a, a young group and a, a new group of starters. Right there, a lot of pressure on the line, and uh, did what we had to do to to go get the win. Uh, so really proud of the guys for that. I think we're 70 and two now when taking a lead in the fourth quarter. And uh, obviously, got to give the guys a lot of credit. But you know, Joey Batson, his strength staff. I mean, that's impressive. That's an impressive staff. It's more than that's a lot of players over a lot of years right there. And uh, to be able to, to uh, physically be able to finish the game in the fourth quarter says a lot. Also proud of the offensive line and those running packs, 227 yards uh, versus that defensive front. They haven't been giving up a whole lot of rushing yards. Uh, obviously, that was a big difference in the game. Multitude of backs uh, having opportunities. Obviously, Travis had two big touchdowns and uh, close to 100 yards. And, um, you know, so proud of that. Uh, proud to get the victory. You know, these kind of games, uh, you got to earn them. They're, they're never easy. And it doesn't matter if you've got experienced guys. I mean, go back to last year's game, Deshaun Watson and all those guys, it came down to the fourth quarter. And we had to go find a way to get it done. You know, this year it looked a little bit different, but it was the same thing. It came down to the fourth quarter, and we, even with all the adversity and all the things that maybe um, we left out there, to really finish with two touchdown drives, I think says a lot about uh, our guys. Uh, you know, mentality and the way you um, respond to the adversity. You know, the things that happen, drop ball, you know, those type of things, uh, you know, disappointing. But what are you going to do next? How are you going to come back and respond? And I uh, felt like, you know, that's probably the best thing we're doing right now is, is responding. Um, our goal is to be able to play four quarters consistently and uh, f still feel like our best ball offensively is out there for us. And, uh, you know, we'll work to, to uh, you know, get better and, and play the best uh, we can here uh, as we finish up the season. Jeff, you mentioned uh, the young guys early in, uh, on offense. Do you feel like they're still growing and, and, and it's still a work? Yeah. Not a total work in progress. Yeah, I mean, yeah there, there's no doubt. Um, you know, our, our goal is to play four quarters consistently. And, uh, you know, the plays that, uh, you know, first of all, you got to give Florida State credit. You know, you, you look at their record and all that, uh, I don't think it really tells the story of their defense. <laughs> their defense has held Alabama to their lowest number, held NC State to their lowest number, all those type of things. You know, but really, whenever we go back and watch this video, there's a lot of things that, uh, you know, just basic things. Handoff, you know, the mesh, quarterback, running back, catching and throwing basic, you know, easy uh, routes. It's, it's not anything uh, complicated. And that's the biggest thing for our guys to understand is mentally they got to stay focused and really just stay in the moment and be able to execute. And I think we will. I've seen us do that uh, in practice. And, um, you know, it's you don't want to continue to have these, but, you know, there are some val valuable lessons you learn from it, and now the next step is really to, to put four quarters together uh, so we can play our best here down the stretch in the championship season. How concerning some of Kelly's maybe missed easy throws where, where he had some opportunities and wasn't able to convert? Yeah, uh, I mean, obviously uh, when that happens, it's very glaring. Um, you know, there's other guys that make mistakes and maybe, you know, the average eye wouldn't see it. And uh, Kelly's not been perfect, but man, how impressive is that for him to come in and, and be 9-1 and one and win a division in his first year starting. With all the pressure and everything on him, uh, you know, he's only going to get better uh, because of the type of person he is, how hard he works. And I, I know that uh, there's nobody that's going to work harder uh, to go back and get some of that improved. And then, you know, it, it also goes both ways. You know, we had opportunities with a deep ball that could have really put the game away. He threw a nice ball and we didn't make the play. So that's just kind of how, uh, who we've been a little bit uh, here over the last few weeks, and we'll get that corrected. But I got no doubt, uh, we got a lot of trust and faith in Kelly. And, you know, we've had great quarterbacks in the past that kind of were off at times. And uh, he, he's no different than that. Uh, but you know, I think he's going to continue to get better here uh, as we go.